Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I feel like I've been waiting to do this video for so long, but I'm gonna finally do my big annual reset for 2024. I have like a really good feeling about next year, but I feel like the only way I can truly go into the new year is if I do like a big reset. And I have of course made a to-do list. And over the next few days, I am going to be taking off that to-do list and help to prepare me for the new year. So it is New Year's Eve right now. And like, I, I can't believe it's New Year's Eve. It just doesn't feel real to me. So I'm going to be taking off a few things today just to help me get a little bit more prepared for the new year. And yeah. so please subscribe and let's get on with today's video. So I have my to-do list here that I did on notes earlier. And the first thing I really want to do is take down my Christmas decorations because I feel like I can't go into the new year with my Christmas tree still up. Like I feel like I just have to take it down even though it's gonna be really sad. And I hate taking down my Christmas decorations, but I have to, I have to take it down. So I'm gonna do that now. because I kind of wanted to go to the shops, but it's fine. Pouring of rain. I feel like the next thing I want to do on my to-do list is change my bed sheet. That is definitely an essential that I have to change before New Year's. Even though I'm not staying here tonight, like it would be so nice just to come back to a fresh set of bedding. I've got my bed sheets here and I'm selling my sister's bed sheets and I just know she's going to be so mad at me. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So I've got about two hours until I'm going to my little gathering party. I don't know what you call it. My little Prosecco. Right. Have my Gordon's gin. I love pink gin. This is my favourite gin ever. Also, by the way, I am 18. I've got a bigger bottle, right? So I was thinking, maybe if I pour some of this in there, then it'll look like it's a full bottle, even though I've drunk from both. I think it would look better if I had a full bottle. So I'm gonna like pour in. Wow, look at that, it looks brand spanking new and I love it. Okay, I can't lie, I had been playing Roblox with Kieran. But now I actually need to get ready because I've got like, maybe like 20, 30 minutes to get ready. Oh, why do I always leave it so late? This is the outfit, jeans, nice top, can't go wrong. I'm so, oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> It's actually January the 3rd now, and the reason why I didn't do anything on the 1st and 2nd is literally because I was with family and I was working. And because I'm going back to college next week, I have just spent this whole week just prepping for the actual new year. This is like my test run. So today, me and Katie are going to the gym for the first time. We've joined a brand new gym. And I can't lie, this is probably one of like the most expensive gyms in our area, but we've decided that it's gonna be priority and I've already girl mapped it and it's okay. It's, we justified the price and we're going today and I'm so excited. I just need to get into my gym clothes now. If you like this sweater, it's from Emio and you can get money off of the code Lottie20 is in my link tree in the description below. I'm gonna go get dressed now. I think the good thing about being a retired gym girl is I've already got so many gym clothes. Obviously, this white fox jumper is not part of my gym outfit. I've got my Gymshark leggings, Gymshark top. I also have a Gymshark sports bra that I'm wearing. And I've also got a little North Face fleece that I'm going to wear as well. The hoodie's just for comfort while we get there. So let's go to the gym. Yay!
So after the gym, I went home and my best friend Becca came round and we ordered so much sushi. Like, I actually think sushi is my favorite food. I have it so much. It literally tastes so, so good. And we just chilled and chatted and it was literally such a fun little evening. And then I decided I am going to do a massive revamp on my vision board. So before I came home, I actually went to Boots and I got loads and loads of pictures for my little redecoration. And it turned out so, so cute. Like the pictures I printed out, like all matched my room perfectly perfectly and i am literally obsessed with it i also printed off some cute little quotes and the overall outcome of my vision board literally inspired me I, i'm so obsessed with it no way to wait just to not seem desperate the only thing i hear today is what the master speak need to take some extra time to hear my master speak but my pride aside to see what he would ask me my head a couple friends just to see if they were fast It's not completely done, but I like how it is at the moment. <laughs> Okay, so it is the next day and I think this is the final part of my New Year's reset and it is now all on my Mac. So I have been currently working on a new 2024 Notion because I had one last year and I literally love it. Like Notion is my favourite thing ever. And I have been working on a 2024 one. It's not completely finished, but I love it. And I also want to look on Pinterest to find some inspiration and stuff. So let me show you what i have been working on so this is my notion so far it's very vanilla girl i guess i love my notions having themes so this theme is more like light white creams like um and i have a little tagline that says everything happens for a reason i live by this and obviously it isn't finished because this section here is not done but um i have this bit in my journal um, so there's little logs that I can put in which I haven't done yet, which I kind of want to do that um, I have my goals. So I have my monthly goals and daily habits my ins and outs and Just some big goals as well. The recipes one is probably my favorite um, So obviously I have my shopping list and meal ideas for upcoming week and so if you see here like the chipotle chicken burrito bowl if you click on the little arrow there's the ingredients i thought it's very organized whenever i can't think of a meal idea i can just go on there and look um my mumps so this section i didn't do in my last notion but this is like my goals for each month so these are my january goals and i did a little january mood board so my january goals is mainly based on like working out and health even though i will be doing that every month but like i'm prioritizing that in january so i really want to like focus on my well-being and eating healthy working out staying hydrated and i think each month is going to have like a different goal but also with like similar intentions um, so I, this bit I just had my daily tasks, very simple, I had that on my last notion. For finance I have my wish list and budgeting, but I also need just a little section here so let me know if you guys have any other ideas I can put on my notion. And I just have my little weekly schedule. I feel like it is quite basic at the moment but obviously I will make it so much better because I do have a year to do my notion. So for Pinterest, obviously Pinterest is the greatest thing ever. And I've been looking on here for a lot of inspiration about what I want my year to look like and stuff. Obviously, I have my vision board. So I literally just love Pinterest so much. It's the cutest thing. And it just, like, makes me so inspired. Like, I've been trying to come on Pinterest more instead of, like, going on TikTok and scrolling. I'd rather scroll on Pinterest because it just makes me so much more motivated. It just gives me inspiration for what I want my life to look like. Like, my hair goals because... Was my hair looking a bit brunette at the moment? Um, just outfit ideas, food ideas, or what I want my bedroom to look like. I love it so so much. I also want to start posting more invented. My vintage will be in the link in the description. It's mine and my best friend Becca's account, so you can also buy some stuff that she's put on there as well. And that is pretty much the end of this video. So I really really hope you enjoyed it. Let me know your New Year's goals and what you guys want to achieve this year because. I have got such good vibes about this year. And please subscribe. I love you guys so, so much. Bye.